Hi everyone, so there have been a lot of developments lately from the Xiaomi Pad 5 community lately, where the awesome devs have released a new huge update to the drivers and UEFI for the Mi Pad 5. If you want to apply these updates to your existing Dual Boot Pad 5, this is a quick guide for you. We will be releasing a separate video for the updated installation method of Windows 11 to your Mi Pad 5. Just power off the device and reboot to fast boot mode by pressing the power button and lower volume button simultaneously. Then connect the device to computer via USB cable. Of course you need to download all these files. Download links are provided in the description box below. First thing you need to do is to extract the platform tools. Once extracted, open command prompt by typing CMD. Boot the recovery image by typing the following commands. After typing the commands, your device will boot to Orange Fox Recovery. Just don't touch anything. Go back to CMD screen and type ADB shell MSC. Just type again the commands if you see this notification until it says done. Now open disk part and check the volume list the Wenabu drive should be assigned with letter X, as you can see in the screen. But for the sake of this tutorial, we will show how it's done. Type select volume number four. Because Wenabu is found in volume four, next command is assign letter X. Just type exit to leave. As you can see here, the Wenabu or the Windows partition of our Pad 5 is now accessible. Next thing to do is to extract the drivers. Just run the offline updater bat file and wait until it's done installing the new drivers. It may take some time. Lastly, we need to boot back to fast boot mode for us to flash the new UEFI. Just type the following commands to boot back to fast boot. Once done, just type fast boot flash boot, then paste the path of the UEFI version 3 image, then hit enter. Type Fastboot Reboot to boot to system. Once all steps are done, you should have the updated drivers and UEFI. These latest drivers will fix bugs like the Xiaomi keyboard compatibility, prime core frequency adjustments that makes Windows boot up even faster, and many more. If this video helps you, don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Cheers.